This tutorial demonstrates how to submit your deal to a lender in the Mortgage Boss 5.1 system. The first thing you need to do is open the deal that you want to submit. Once you have access to the deal, you will scroll down past your application details and select the tab that reads Lender Submit. Under the Lender Submit tab, you will see a breakdown of your deal information. Below this, you will see a heading that reads Applicants. Here you will notice to the left of each applicant name is a teal checkbox. This checkbox gives you the ability to select which applicants you want to submit to the lender. For example, in this deal, my third applicant might be stopping me from submitting to a particular lender. If this is the case, I can simply remove them from the submission while keeping the applicant on the deal in BOSS and not having to remove them entirely from the application by just unchecking the box. On the right-hand side of the applicant section, you will notice a column that reads primary applicant. This is where you can designate which applicant is the primary applicant upon submission. You can do this with a simple click of a button. You do not have to manually change the order of your applicants in the deal to designate the primary applicant, which would take extra time and work. Instead, you can simply select the checkbox under primary applicant upon submitting to the lender, just like this. Now, my second applicant listed is going to be the primary applicant upon submitting to the lender. Below applicants, you will notice an application section. This application section will show up if you have more than one mortgage requested. This is where you can select the mortgage request for this particular lender submission by selecting the checkbox beside the mortgage. Next, you will go to the submission section of the lender submit tab. Here, you will see lender notes. These lender notes appear upon being entered into the deal notes section under the notes tab on the left side of your deal. However, under lender notes, you have the ability to enter additional notes that you may have for a particular lender when you are submitting the deal to that given lender. For example, you may have different notes that you want to submit when you're submitting to TD Bank versus Scotiabank. This is the section where you can manipulate and add those additional notes. Before submitting to the lender, Click on the black validate button on the right hand side of the deal to ensure that everything is in order upon submission. Once all validation requirements are fulfilled, you will select the lender drop down list and select your lender from this list. The last step you need to take is selecting the teal submit button at the bottom right hand corner of the lender submit tab. Once you hear back from the lender, you will then go to the Lender Response tab directly below the Lender Submit tab within your deal. Under the Lender Response tab, you will notice a drop down beside Response Type. This is a filter to see a particular response, for example, Approved. You will then see two different buttons on the right hand side of the Lender Response. The first button reads Preview. The Preview button will show you the broker documents linked to the lender's response. Here, you can download each individual document. You will also notice a Details button. When you select the Details button, this will display the information that you have submitted to the lender, including the mortgage information, and at the bottom, you will view lender notes. This is where you will see the lender's response. If you run into any issues or need any assistance at all, please reach out to the Mortgage Boss support team. This is how to submit to a lender in Mortgage Boss 5.1.